Well, more reactions have continued to trail the state of the nation's economy following the current hardship being faced as a result of the fuel price hike, as well as the rush to swap the old narrow note for new ones. A human rights activist, Patrick Eholo, who spoke with our correspondent in Edo State, believes that the citizens are being taken for granted by the present administration. Well, you know, this, uh, this government, whether the past or present, the insulting intelligence, the thing that's for granted, you know, um, everybody blame each other. We're playing the blame game, and we have a government. It yeah, can't be so. If there's regulation, and the government said prices are fixed, we should sell the floor, for example, for 190. It should be 190. And maybe body violates it, the person has to be prosecuted. And if it's the marketer, the marketer has to be sanctioned. But the issue is that the US has law like any other country. They have policy like any other country. Our problem is that we don't have implementation because of nepotism, favoritism, and corruption. Because we are afraid to sanction certain people. We know the root of our problem, but we have the guts to tackle. Despite the announcement of a postponement by the CBN, he says the citizenry is not without blame. We are passing the chunk of the blame to a mefele. We are passing it to President Buhari. But we, as citizens too, also have our own blame. It wasn't announced today. You were given time to ensure you take your own narrow notes to deposit it because we are trying to live by the policy again of cashless society, right? But the issue is that many Nigerians are thinking that when they take 10 million to the bank, they will have an extent of 10 million in cash. My observation is that perhaps it wasn't explained to the general public by the central bank, which is their responsibility. And then the bankers that I tag corporate criminals. I've written to a and dragged into the floor of the city to explain to us why we have 200 naira, 500 naira, new notes, perhaps even 1,000 in obituaries and marriages. And when we go to the bank, we don't have access to the new notes. 